Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss about how to create asset for such cases where inventory is already installed but not capitalized and is still lying in our SAP storage location or warehouse because we have two options to create the asset from the inventory. First one is internal order case where we are going we have processed to direct consumptions direct procurement of the assets like uh, uh, laptop computers are the assets which are directly in can create and directly in use okay the second option we have the ps route uh, we have certain created the project definition wbs and plan the inventory in that projects and then good issue against project then we will capitalize and directly post the cost of inventory in the assets okay but in those two cases uh, we have certain planning and the budget requirement for the exceptional cases where the budget is not available and the inventory is already pending from the long time due to various issues so we have to uh, follow this process and uh, you can discuss with your finance team for any issues or any suggestion regarding the same okay so we are trying to execute the this process okay we have checked the plan code 3002 sloc uh, 1000 and uh, material is which I am going to capitalize 12003484 fine okay so I am going to use this material okay for the capitalization purpose execute the transaction code MB52 okay I am going to execute the transaction code MB52 and the plan code is 3002 storage location is 1000 I'm just here checking the initial quantity of this inventory. Okay, this is splitter wall mount 2 to 32 G pawn. 65 quantity is available in the warehouse. Okay, so I'm just going to assetize the single quantity of this uh, splitter wall mount in assets. Okay, so use the trend. Initial quantity is 65. I'm just going to uh, mention that initial quantity is 65 fine and uh, we need to copy this Now the second option is we need to create the asset of this inventory for the further execution okay uh, for this you need to discuss with the finance team and finance team will create the asset using a01 okay in the a01 the asset class is the repair uh, there is a various uh, asset class so you can choose the appropriate asset class i have choosing 9903 and that is the operation plan my company code is 1100 okay and i'm just click click enter for the posting of the this okay description is test case fine and uh, serial number inventory number the quantity you can put here like this I'm just putting this this material code quantity one okay so you can fill the various parameters here and discuss with your finance team and in the business area uh, 3002 uh, cost center it is CFA 3002 201 you can choose your appropriate cost center 
land code is 3002 the location you can choose from the drop down for example i have chosen the anupalam exchange and the row number is test one okay and uh, in allocation tab you can uh, choose like for example administrative offices subclass you can choose uh, i have chosen the ANP uh, TDM switching equipment okay and the reason this is urban so I have chosen urban the component tab you can choose a drop down PABX okay legacy GL account if you have then you can choose this okay and uh, investment support measure key description and all you can fill here or is in uh, like with vendor detail manufacturer detail type name original assets acquisition on for example i have uh, filling the acquisition date 14 2022 okay and original value you can discuss with the finance team okay insurance uh, if you can fill the insurance tab in the depreciation key uh, the book depreciation book depreciation income tax and all these you can discuss with the finance team and accordingly the depreciation will be posted here okay and here i am just going to post um, the asset value is created here this asset number is created and you can note down like this okay now you need to create the reservation using mb21 using the material same material okay using this material okay this material and using this as asset okay i'm just executing the transaction code mb21 mb21 here the date is the current date movement type you need to choose Z41. Okay. Z41 is C consumption for asset from warehouse. Okay. Consumption for asset from the warehouse. Z41. Okay. Plant is uh, 3002. And here to click on the new items. Here you need to copy the asset number which we have uh, created here. Okay. okay good recipient is uh, sdtx for example and uh, material you need to copy the material which you have to post in the inventory okay and uh, the quantity is one number and uh, siloshi is thousand and if you want to put up the batch number and all details you can put here i'm just going to simply post the system has generated the reservation number this okay simple has simply generate the reservation number and you need to copy this reservation number like this the next step is uh, run miko good issue against reservation and posting date is 1st February 2023 so we can post two month depreciation on the current fiscal year okay I'm just going to post this next step is uh, post the document MIZO MIGO that is goods issue against reservation and I have just put the reservation number here directly. See the data uh, goods issue inventory to asset. Okay, and you can fill this dates splitter mall amount. Okay, and where the text we can mention okay 
gi into sh fine and you can uh, change this date like uh, first Feb first february 2023 if system is not allowing uh, the same then you can uh, put the same date it is the current date okay click on this uh, print active and uh, here click on the item ok ok and click on the check if this green indicator is appear then there is a no error ok and I have here just uh, going to post this ok we have successfully posted ok we have successfully posted okay just put the document number now you need to uh, check the inventory of the same material code initial quantity 65 one quantity we have posted in the assets so it will be reduced by one one number fine so i'm just going to check the warehouse stock uh, using mp52 okay the same i'm just going to check in the mb 52 the same material see same material same storage location same stock initially it was 65 we have already noted here see now i'm just going to check it will 64 okay 64 amount is 64 quantities there so one quantities has been reduced and it is posted in the assets okay okay so now the next quantity next you need to check the asset value you can uh, check in the AR02. AR02. So I'm going to uh, check in the AR02. Fine. AR02. See. This is our company code and uh, here you can uh, check this asset number which we have successfully created here okay and uh, in the report date is this and the depreciation posted you can tick this okay see see the capitalization date, asset date, acquisition value, and current uh, APC description, depreciation start, and all these things is current book value is this. Okay, you can check the description from here. The asset description you can include in this. The same asset description splitter test case. Okay fine and you if you if you click on this uh, asset then system will give you the entries details apc transaction is this year in this ordinary depreciation is posted like this and here the transaction type name withdrawal from the stock asset value date is this okay so system will give you all the details like this so our process has been completed right now here okay you can discuss the same with your finance team because uh, basically your account officer is responsible for the asset posting parameters and all the details okay you can discuss get the proper authorizations and use these special cases in sap because uh, we have certain procedures we are not uh, doing this process for but for certain cases we can Take the approval with the our finance team with the administrative team and you can utilize this thank you